Hi friends, in this video, I will show you how you can make your Windows 11 run times better or faster in just 5 minutes. This is a quick and easy way to make your Windows 11 run faster. So please follow the process one by one. Let us go and check what is the current status of my PC right now, my laptop right now. For that, just right click on the taskbar and take Task Manager. Here, just go to the performance. Here, you can see that the process running is 214. It's very high right now. And the memory consumed is 5.8 GB out of 8 GB. So, let's go and make this Windows 11 run faster. So, for that, first you have to go to the settings. Open the settings and go to the system. From here, just scroll down and click on storage. Now just go down and turn the storage sense on. Now it will start searching for the cleanup recommendations. Let the scanning complete. Complete, just expand this window. Now just click on advanced option. Now here you will get the recommended files to be deleted. You can see that a lot of files are available right now. Just leave this download uh, unchecked because this is the folder where you have downloaded your favorite file songs and uh, I image. To refresh and check once again, just go and refresh it once again. Now once that is done, just click on remove files. Just click continue. Now you can see that the files are removed. If you want to remove the temporary files, you can check that. Otherwise, you can leave it blank. And here you can see that the previous Windows installations file will be available here. If you want to save some storage, then you can select that and uh, remove it. So for the timing, I'm leaving it like that. Now from there, just go to the privacy and security. Now just scroll down. Now just open. You have to do some changes with the app permissions for that. Just open the location. Now turn on. Now turn off this location services. Now go back. Now just open the camera. If you are not using the camera regularly, then you can turn this off feature. Now go back. If you are using Bluetooth, then don't turn this radio access control off. You can leave it on because I am using the Bluetooth. I have to leave it on. In your case, if you are not using any Bluetooth devices, you can turn this off. Now once that is completed, just go to the Apps tab. Now here you have to uninstall the unwanted or the apps which you are not using regularly. So for that, just click on the installed apps. Here you will get the list of apps which is right now installed on your PC or laptop. I'm not using cheap clamp, so I'm just removing it. Now once that is completed, just go to the task manager and now click on the startup apps. Here you will get the list of apps that is on the startup. So you can disable the apps which you don't require on the startup. For example, I don't want nearby share on uh, the startup. So just right click on and uh, disable it. Don't want hide me. So I'm just disabling it. Now once that is done, just close this window. Now just right click on uh, the windows icon. Then take run and type sys em dot 
CPL. Okay, you will get the system properties from there. Go to the advanced, then click on the settings, and now change the option to adjust for best performance. And here you will get it all unchecked. From here, you can select a few of them. Box, then click on apply and click on OK. And click OK. Now, the next step is to click on the search and uh, type in optional features. You'll get it here. On it. Now here you will get a list of features installed, additional features installed in this computer. You can turn off. First thing is you can uninstall the that explorer mode. Next one is math recognizer. So if you are not using PowerShell, you can uninstall it. Now once that is done, just close the window. Now the next step is to open Notepad. Now type in here the following command. I'll share this in the description, you can copy it from there. Go to file and click on save as and change this to all files and save it as bbloater. Okay. Close this and see that the bat file is created. So I click on it and open it. Wait for the script to be processed. Once it is processed, you will get a window where you can configure the rest of the things. Now here in this window, you just go to the three option. Now select which is your uh, device. If it is desktop, laptop. So I'm going to select laptop here in my case. So you will get the best optimization here. I'll select remove one drive here. From here I'll select Google. I'll just run Pix. Now once the tips are completed, just close down this window. Now you have to restart your computer again. Just restart it. I have restarted my laptop. Now let's go and check the performance. Okay, you can see that the process has been significantly reduced to 103 from 221 earlier. And you can see that the memory consumption is uh, reduced to 3.7 GB out of 8 GB. So this is how you can uh, speed up your uh, Windows 11. Uh, hope you have enjoyed this uh, video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like and share. Thank you.